libraries are accustomed to thinking in terms of 100 year, 200 year, 300 year, 500 year time frames. So we think about this digital environment and the challenge that it represents to us and we clearly have a big research agenda here to understand how to capture and preserve bits going forward. So how do you capture, organize, manage, reproduce, store, and preserve digitally formatted information which you cannot see. Well, you can see a book on the shelf. You can tell if it's degrading. You can tell if you can still work it. But in the digital environment, you can't see those materials. And so you have to have structures and systems in place that make it possible for people to preserve their critical work going forward. So I think Hewlett Packard imagined that if they could work with us to build a prototype that would be a very interesting experiment. We launched DSpace in November of 2002 at a very popular launch event around the topic of scholarly communication. The response to it and the uptake of it has been phenomenal, but there are two areas that we really need to focus in on. The first is digital preservation. How do you keep digital assets alive for hundreds of years? How would you preserve a database so that a scholar 100 years from now can look at it and see what scholars today were working on? Nobody really quite understands how to do that yet, and it's an area we've positioned ourselves very well to work on. The other area is in metadata. Metadata is information about data. It's the kind of information that you need to discover digital assets, to manage them and preserve them over time. So an example of this from the current world might be a library card catalog, which you would use to find things in the library, or uh, probably more familiar to a lot of techies would be Amazon, where you're looking at books using information about those books. Working with HP Labs on this project has been wonderful. I could not have asked for a more responsive, interested, and engaged group of people than we got from HP. The experience has been absolutely fabulous.